Akita Therapeutics, Wikipedia article audio. Akita Therapeutics until November 2014 is a biotechnology company located in Marlboro, Massachusetts, United States. The company specializes in the development and commercialization of cell therapies for the treatment of a variety of diseases. Akita is primarily developing stem cell-based technologies, both adult and human embryonic, and other methods and treatments in the area of regenerative medicine. In November 2015 the company announced it would be acquired by Estella's Pharma for $379 million, which was finally completed in February 2016. History Research Formed in 1994, the company was led from 2005 to late 2010 by William M. Caldwell IV, Chairman and Chief Executive Officer. Upon Mr. Caldwell's death on December 13, 2010, Gary Robin, a member of AXE Board of Directors with experience in investment and capital raising, assumed the role of chairman and CEO. In 2007 the company's chief scientific officer, Michael D. West, Ph.D., also founder of Jaron left Akita to join a regenerative medicine firm, Biotime as CEO. In 2008, for $250,000 plus royalties up to a total of $1 million, the company licensed its ACT Celerate technology to Biotime. Robert Lanza was appointed CSO. On November 22, 2010, the company announced that it had received approval from the U.S. Food and Drug Administration to initiate the first human clinical trial using embryonic stem cells to treat retinal diseases. A preliminary report of the trial published in 2012, and a follow-up article was published in February 2015. In July 2014, Akita announced that Paul K. Watton, previously of Antares Pharma Inc., became president and chief executive officer. On August 27, 2014, Akita announced a 1 to 100 reverse stock split of its common stock. Akita was listed on Nasdaq in February 2015. Macular Degeneration On November 30, 2010, Akita filed an investigational new drug application with the US FDA for the first clinical trial using embryonic stem cells to regenerate retinal pigment epithelium to treat dry age-related macular degeneration. Dry AMD is the most common form of macular degeneration and represents a market size of $25-30 billion in the US and Europe. In November 2010 the FDA allowed Akita to begin a Phase I-2 human clinical trial to use its retinal pigment epithelium cell therapy to treat Stargard disease, a form of inherited juvenile macular degeneration. Stargard's disease